The state of Colorado has a long and deep history in mining. In the early days, miners would take donkeys through the mountains while they were prospecting. Because the donkeys were carrying supplies, the miners couldn't ride the animal, so they would walk in front, leading the donkey. This historical form of transport spawned a unique sporting event. The burro races, which are held throughout small towns in Colorado, commemorate those old-timey miners and their donkeys. Burro, of course, being the Spanish word for donkey. Legend has it that the races began when two miners found gold in the same location at the same time and had to race back to town to get to the claims office first. Because the donkeys were loaded with gear, the miners couldn't ride them, so the miners were forced to run, leading the burros as they endeavoured to be the first to make their claim. Nowadays, the races are so popular that in 2012, burro pack racing was recognised as the official summer heritage sport in Colorado. So, what are the rules for this unusual sport? Well, it's pretty straightforward. The three main races each year vary in length between 20 and 47 kilometers, and over the prescribed course, the team must be tethered together by a 4.6 meter rope, and the humans must be in control of their donkeys at all times. The humans are allowed to carry their donkey if needed, but they're not permitted to ride it. The rules are that the animals must carry a pack saddle with a minimum of 15 kilos of traditional mining gear, which must include a pick, a gold pan, and a shovel. Cruelty to the donkeys is strictly forbidden, and the donkeys have to be available after a race for inspection by a veterinarian. Cruelty of any kind is rare, though, and many pub stories tell of strong bonds formed between human and animal as they face the elements and chase victory. These bonds forged in battle make for a strong team, and these unusual racing companions form a key part of a connection to history. Burrow racing keeps this tradition alive and help us all remember our past and how far we've come. <laughs>